Good morning, Miss House. Unfortunately, I have your bad news for the day. It says here that your twin sister has been in an accident and... <gasps> <sighs> <laughs> Ever think of going somewhere else? <laughs> Stop laughing. What, like travel? Sure. Uh, I've done enough traveling in my lifetime. What about moving, just going somewhere else? Well, yeah, occasionally the thought crosses my mind, but uprooting like that wouldn't be good for me. Or you, if that's what this is building towards. I think it'd be good for me. Huh. I'd rethink your strategy. That's a rough day. Chin up, Benny. Mr. Norton, Mrs. Vogelcheck, Mr. Platibus, Mrs. Shembla. You've been summoned by the courts to stand trial for the double murder and cannibalism of Paul and Phil. Your uh, assigned employee needs to be let go for insubordination. Your drug-riddled son choked on his vomit and is now stuck in a coma. Your wife is pregnant with your neighbor's baby. And it looks like tomorrow will be just as funny and perfect as today. Thank you for tuning in to GNN. I'm your good newsman, Bob Trin, reminding you to save your troubling info for your local bad newsman. Although, I wouldn't blame you for wanting a break from that sad old drone, ha huh? <laughs> What? Who is he to insult me like that? I'm telling you, there's an asshole hiding behind that toothy fucking alien grin. If he knew half the shit I had to deal with daily, he'd be thanking me. I could do his job easy. People like you don't get those jobs, or any other ones. Everyone has their designated place, including me. What else would you even do, anyway? That's dark, and... Uh, I don't know. But I'll take anything at this point. If you have no plan, what do you keep bothering me for? It's not like you work in a poisonous mine. Yeah, but- Just b do your job. Resigning's bad news for you. Mr. Neves? <sighs> your food truck has been condemned by the Public Health Association for violations against cleanliness. Could- Could I order a number two- uh, your cat was poisoned by your neighbor. I'm really sorry, miss. <laughs> Fuck you, Sheila. Hey, newsman. You got my wife put away? Well, she kind of got herself ready. Jesus, did the cat reanimate? I was 50% sure it was still dead. <laughs> I think this is it for me. Okay, don't start with this again. Nope. I'm done. No, it's not done. It's never done for you, Betty. It can't be. Just listen to me. I'm trying to help you. Keeping me here isn't helping me. I don't know what else to tell you, man. The line has been crossed. Find someone else, because I'm not showing up tomorrow. Benny, stop. Fine, fine. You wanna quit so bad? Huh? You wanna see what that means for you? Then come on, buddy. Let's get you fired. Is this a joke? Just remember, you asked for this. So where am I- Set! Stop fucking with me, man! Set!
what's happening? You're getting what you want. 